This is my CK80 Pro, a full-size keyboard sent to me to review by BZ Future, a consumer website that sells many authorized bonus speed keyboards, allowed me the opportunity to showcase its updated version. Compared to its predecessor, the CK80, the main difference really is the painted case. It has this rainbow look to it which makes it look very flashy, something you don't see in many budget style keyboards. They're usually black or white, plastic or aluminum. Though it being plastic, it still has this very fine roughness to it. The color and texture sort of looks like they took a CK80 and repainted it. Well, it, it kind of looks that way. Nothing is fundamentally different other than the change in colored keycaps and sticking to Zeus optical waterproof switches as its only switch option, which we'll get to a bit later. Just to be clear, the CK80 has three switch options, two way color caps, while the Pro has a new paint job with one switch option and has all black caps. Though this is a review for the updated version, it's more of a video on the CK80's core features. In the end, you'll decide which one is best because they both have this thing called the rotary knob which controls the volume and with the press, switches to brightness control. Once you plug it in, you'll notice one of CK80's stark design. It has this four-sided illuminated rainbow bar that really is the keyboard's main draw. You can change rainbow to solid, change those colors, solid to breathing, change those as well, and use a single spectrum, which just goes through them all. And you can turn it off. Real dope. With the black keycaps and small backlit legends, it sort of lacks strong RGB within the keyboard. Either way, changing it up, here's what it looks like with aura and translucent keycaps. The keyboard itself has some flex. Underneath, we get X cross design rubber feet, and only one height adjustment position. The cord is a non-detachable USB cord. Keycaps, like I said, are black, but also backlit, PBT, and in the OEM profile. But the switches are Zeus optical clicky switches. Hmm. So apparently these switches have a laser inside them or some chip that activates when you press down, which is different from mechanical ones. This is more accurate when typing, and it's very apparent with its short actuation. I tried to trick it by pressing very slowly, and no matter what, it immediately inputted right when I heard the click. I can trick my kale box whites, but for some reason I can't with this switch. Apart from the switches being IP68, the stabilizers are pretty average. They have some rattle, it's more apparent on the spacebar though. It's just something you get when you pay for a budget keyboard like this. The keyboard has RGB lighting and effects so you can change through its shortcuts, but it's easier if you just use the Moda Speed software. Its software is very minimal. Assign some keys, lighting effects, macros, standard stuff. It would be great if they added an option to change the RGB of the four-sided bars through like a, some sort of visual UI. That would have been pretty great. The Motospeed CK80 Pro is the keyboard that just takes every mark for what a budget keyboard can do and perform, while upgrading aspects of its design whereas other keyboard manufacturers just ignore. The four bar illumination is insane. But if you had to choose, I would maybe go for its original since you do get different keycaps and more switches like the Automoot Gold or Silver. But those won't be IP68, which just means that it has some sense of like a waterproof or water resistance. And what's cool is that it has support towards PS4 and many other gaming consoles. I do hope in the future I can turn this keyboard into some sort of DIY project since its case is just so unique. Big thanks to BZ Future for sending this keyboard out. Those guys are always having promos, but also you can just get this keyboard 10% off with my discount code BZSAN. They also have a software promotion page with cheaper software as low as half off, which after you'll receive a Windows 10 OEM key as a gift. I don't make any money from this code or any links to their website. It's just for you guys to save if you ever do plan on getting this keyboard. And finally, here's a typing test on the Zeus optical switches. I'll see you guys around, all right? Take care. Three, two, one.